Pleasure and happiness are very often mixed up together. And happiness is used then as a synonym for pleasure. But there is another quality in happiness which is deeper than that. Pleasure just means that um, I'm very hot and somebody gives me an ice cream, it cools me down for a little while, I have pleasure in that, and then when I finish the ice cream, I'm hot again. But happiness is a state of mind, different from pleasure. The happiness that we're looking for is a state of mind which is with us all the time, without exception. And that happiness is, is related to the joy of seeing other people being happy or achieving what they want or being released from their suffering in some way. So there's joy involved in that. That happiness is about, also comes from recognising the great kindness that we have from other people that mostly we don't recognise. But if I look at my robes, all right, I've got a, all this stuff over me, but where did this come from? And, and it's a combination of nylon and cotton. So the nylon would have come from a factory and people would have had to build the factory. People would have had to pick the cotton. The cotton would have had to be spun. All this had to be put together and then it had to be dyed. There are countless people involved in just producing my robes. And without them, I wouldn't have these robes. So when we recognise this great kindness of others, then our hearts are also filled with pleasure because we know we're not alone. Usually we feel that we are alone, nobody cares about us. But when we think of that, then we realise we are part of an enormous system where there is kindness. And there, then there is the happiness. And this is probably the deepest of happinesses. This happiness comes from when we realise we don't need this ego that we thought we needed, the one we assumed that was in here, which we have to save. We realise that the whole thing is a myth. It doesn't exist. And so all its reactions, all its anger and jealousy and so on and so forth, become irrelevant. So we don't have those reactions anymore. And so we don't have negative feelings towards others anymore. And so they're much less likely to have negative feelings towards us. But because we don't have those negative feelings towards us, others, we are happy non-stop. It just goes on. There's no reason to be unhappy.